There you are. Sorry for calling you up here like this. I bet Kawakami already told you stuff like, don't get involved with him, huh? <laughs> I thought you'd say that. I heard you got a criminal record. Everyone's talking about it. No wonder you were so gutsy. What was all that that happened? You know, how we almost got killed at a castle. It wasn't a dream, right? You remember it too, yeah? Well, just because we both remember it doesn't mean much, though. I mean, even if it was a dream, you saved me from Kamoshida. So yeah, uh, thanks. That man, that Kamoshida we saw there. You probably don't know about it, but there are some rumors about him. You know, the guy you met at the school gates. The ripped one. That asshole who was all full of himself at the castle. No one says anything against him because he's some medalist who took the volleyball team to nationals. The way Kamashita was king of that castle felt crazy real because of that. I wonder if we can go back to that castle again. Ah, forget it. It must have all been a dream. It has to be. Sorry to drag you out here like this. That's all I had to say. You know... We might be pretty similar. I feel like we're gonna get along just fine as troublemakers. I'm Ryuji Sakamoto. I'll come talk if I see you around. Don't ignore me, all right? See ya. About time you've come to! On your feet, inmate! Our master wishes to speak with you. It's for your own sake that you take his words to heart. First off, let us celebrate our reunion. Oh, you've awakened to your powers, and special ones at that. Your rehabilitation can finally begin. There is no need to understand it all for the time being. You will be training the power of Persona, which you have awakened to. Personas are, in other words, a mask, an armor of the heart when confronting worldly matters. I have high expectations for you. There is no need to worry. You will learn when the time comes. By the by, have you come to appreciate the Metaverse Navigator? Using it will allow you to come and go between reality and palaces. I bestowed it to you as a means to train you as a thief. The Metaverse Navigator is a gift from our master. You better take care in using it, inmate. Devote yourself to your training so that you may become a fine thief. It must be disheartening to make use of the Metaverse Navigator alone. Should there be others who would prove beneficial to you, 
I will grant it to them as well. This is all for you to grow as a most excellent thief. <laughs> it's time. Go back and enjoy whatever rest you might have. Seriously? Oh, what's going on? Class is starting. What's the answer? Do you know anything? If a huge castle like that really exists, I'm sure we'll find it in no time. When did they build something like that, though? We walked that way from here, right? When you put it that way, I'm not so sure anymore. All right, this way. Let me know if you notice something. wasn't anything out of place along the way, right? I didn't see no castle either. Ah, we must have made a wrong turn somewhere. Let's try again. Don't worry, I won't mess up this time. Let's go. For real? Is it smaller than we think it is? What do you think? I already did that. I didn't see anything like it around here. 
Huh? Phone. Hey, that reminds me. Didn't you have a navigation app thingy on back then? I don't know if it was or not, but I heard stuff that sounded like one coming from your phone. You know, didn't it say stuff like returned to the real world or something like that? Let me see your phone for a bit. What's this eyeball looking thing? What? What a weird app. Oh, wait, this is it. I knew it. It is a navigation app. There's even your search history. Oh man, I'm such a genius. Let's try using it. Why? All we're doing is starting an app. Tamoshida. Shujin Academy. Pervert. Castle. Beginning navigation. Here we go! And then we went in a certain direction and... Hey, what are you... Huh? What the hell? from yesterday. We made it back. That means what happened yesterday was for real too. Yeah! That was close! That happened last time too, huh? What's with that outfit? I don't get it either. What's going on here? This makes no effing sense at all. Hey! Stop making a commotion! Uh, you? The shadows started acting up, so I came here wondering what it could be. <sighs> to think you guys would come back to the entrance when you barely managed to escape. What is this place? Is it the school? That's right. But it's a castle! This castle is the school. But only to this castle's ruler. The castle's ruler? I think you called him Kamoshida? It's how his distorted heart views the school. Kamoshida? Distorted? Explain it in a way that makes sense! I shouldn't have expected a moron to get it. What did you say? <laughs> what was that? It must be the slaves captive here. For real? <laughs> oh shit! It's for real! We saw other guys held captive here yesterday. I'm pretty sure they're from our school. Most likely on Kamoshida's orders. It's nothing out of the ordinary. It's like that every day here. What's more, you two escaped yesterday. He must have lost his temper quite a bit. That son of a bitch! Ryuji? This is bullshit! You hear me, Kamoshida? Doing that isn't going to open it, you know. Still, it seems you have your reasons. Hey, Mona Mona! It's Morgana! Do you know where those voices are coming from? You want me to take you to them? Well, I guess I could guide you there. But only if he comes with us. It's settled then. For real? Thanks, man. All right, let's do this. Follow me. Now then. Huh? Uh... <laughs> Let's go. 
Listen up. Yeah. Let's go. I'll reveal your true you? form. The shadows probably won't come in here. How can you tell? There's a lack of distortion here, meaning the ruler's control over this area is weak. Is this a classroom? Now do you understand? This place is another reality that the ruler's heart projects. This is Kamoshida's reality? Ugh, shit makes no sense at all. One could say it's a world in which one's distorted desires have materialized. I call such a place a palace. A palace? This is happening because he thinks the school is his own castle. So it became like this because he just thought of it like that? <laughs> that son of a bitch! You must really hate this Kamashita guy. Hate doesn't even cover how I feel. Everything is that asshole's fault. I don't know what happened between you two, but don't let your emotions get the better of you. His lackeys are everywhere inside. You're curious about your outfit, aren't you? Yeah, I'm curious as hell about it, too. That's also because of this world. More stuff that makes no sense. Anything distorts according to how a ruler pleases within his palace. A school can turn into a castle like this, after all. In order to prevent such distortions, one must hold a powerful will of rebellion. Your appearance is a manifestation of that. It's the image of rebellion that you hold within. Uh, I'm so fed up with all this. I'm more curious about you than his clothes. What the hell are you anyways? I'm a human. An honest to God human. No, you're obviously more like a cat. This is, well, it's because I lost my true form, I think. You think? But I do know how to regain my true form. The reason why I snuck in here was for a preliminary investigation of those means. Well, I ended up getting caught, though. Besides, I've been tortured by Kamoshita, too. I'm gonna make him pay for sure. What is this, a comic book? This is seriously crazy. If we're gonna keep going, we should hurry along. I'll be counting on your skills this time, too, rookie. Got it? Don't worry, I'm not gonna force it all on you. I thought it might help, so... I brought this just in case. It's a model gun, though, so it only makes sounds. That's a toy! But it looks totally real, so it'll at least fake him out. Oh, I brought some medicine, too. You know what they say, providing is pre-something. Huh? Huh? So you were planning this from the start. Well, fine. If you're ready to go, we'll resume our infiltration.
Okay, let's go. True form. About that. Surprised. Be mindful of how much ammo. Persona! There! Alright, I'll show you my weapon too. Leveled up. For real? <laughs> nice going. Your true form. Now's our chance to stop. Go. You're mine.
Let's go. Listen, there's a distinct flow to battles. Let me show First, knock down all the enemies. Everything starts at that. Persona! Now rush on in for an up. Nice going. Ah. Uh... Now then. Yes! <laughs> yeah. Do I have to tell you to keep your voice down? But this is beyond messed up! How do I open this? Stop it! Leave us alone! It's useless! Huh? If we stay obedient, we won't be executed like you guys. You're telling me you want to stay in a place like this? Wait a minute. Are you planning on taking these guys out of here? We can't just leave them here. How stupid can you be? What? These are only humans in Kamoshida's cognition. They aren't real humans that have entered from reality. They're different from you two. Cognition? It means there's no point in saving them. They're different from the real ones in the real world. You could say that these are extremely similar looking dolls. The hell? Why is it gonna be so complicated? So the school's a castle and the students are slaves. It's so on point that it makes me laugh. This really is the inside of that asshole's head. Still, this is horrible. It must mean he treats them as slaves in the real world, too. In the real world, too? Wait, I know these guys. They're members of the volleyball team, the one Kamoshida coaches for. They must be physically abused every day. There's no way they'd be so beat up normally. Don't tell me. They're going through similar shit in reality? Most likely. I mean, this proves that Kamoshida thinks of them as slaves. So, it might be for real. I heard that Kamoshida's using physical punishment. They're just rumors, but... If they're true, wouldn't this be something to report to the police? I'll use these guys as evidence. If it all goes well, we can take down that asshole Kamoshida! Huh? It's not working. We can use the navigation app, but the camera's a no-go? A navigation app? That's what we used to come here. What about yours? Whatever you do is fine, but we're gonna get caught if we stand around like this. We need to head back. Hang on a sec. There's no other way. I'll just memorize their faces before going home. Let's go! Oh! <laughs> 
Come on, man. <laughs> what are your thoughts? Again? To think you'd make the same mistake again. You're hopeless. The school ain't your castle. I memorized their faces real good. You're going down. It seems it's true when they say barking dogs seldom bite. How far the star runner of the track team has fallen. The hell are you getting at? I speak of the track trader who acted in violence, ending his teammates' dreams. Oh, I can only imagine the pain of the others who were dragged under with your selfish act. <sighs> What a surprise. So you're accompanying him without knowing anything at all. He betrayed his teammates and crushed their hopes. Yet he still carries on as carefree as ever. That's not true! You've come along with this fool and are now going to end up dead. How unlucky of you. Go! Kill them all! Don't sully my castle with garbage. Damn it! Ryuji, move! Uh, we're surrounded! I'll kill you! I'll kill you because King Kamashita told us! I'll kill because that's what he wants! Go down! There's more of them? This is bad. <laughs> Failure! It can't be. You simply came here on a whim and ended up like this, isn't that right? No! What a worthless piece of trash, getting emotional so quickly. How dare you raise your hand at me! Though it was only temporary, have you forgotten my kindness in supervising track practice? It wasn't no practice, it was physical abuse! You just didn't like our team! It was nothing but an eyesore. The only one who needs to achieve results is me. That coach who got fired was hopeless too. Had he not opposed me with a sound argument, I would have settled it with only breaking his star's leg. What? Do you need me to deal with your other leg too? <laughs> the school will call it self-defense anyway. Damn it. Am I gonna lose again? Not only can I not run anymore, the track team is gone too because of this asshole. So that's why. Once these two are dealt with, you're next. <laughs> Ryuji! You're right. 
Everything that was important to me was taken by him. I'll never get him back. Stay there and watch. Look on as these hopeless scum die for nothing because they sided with trash like you. No, that's what you are. All you think about is using people. You're the real scumbag, Kamoshida! What are you doing? Silence him! Stop looking down on me with that stupid smile on your face! You made me wait quite a while. <laughs> You seek power, correct? Then let us form a pact. Since your name has been disgraced already, why not hoist the flag and wreak havoc? The other you who exists within desires it thus. I am thou, thou and I. There is no turning back. The skull of rebellion is your flag henceforth! <laughs> what can you do? Cower in fear and watch! What's up, Persona? This effin' rocks! Now that I got this power, it's time for payback! Yo, I'm ready! Bring it! Don't mock me, you brat! Blast him away, Captain Kid! Troublemakers that bother King Kamoshida in trifle matters. Kamoshida's cognition ain't changing, right? Then I'll act like the troublemaker I am. Let's do this, Captain Kid. Persona, Captain Kid. just proves that Kamoshida ain't anything special. <sighs> Have Whoa. So Ryuji had the potential too. Even if you apologize now, I ain't forgiven you. I told you that this is my castle. It seems you still don't understand. What? Takamaki? Oh! oh what a meowless and beautiful girl! What's going on? that you mention it, but why is she even here? Hey, let go of her, you perv! 
How many times must I tell you until you understand? This is my castle, a place in which I can do whatever I want. Everyone wishes to be loved by me. That is, everyone besides slow-witted thieves like you. Takamaki, say something! Calm down, Ryuji. It seems that girl isn't the real one. She's the same as those slaves. A being made from Kamashita's cognition of her. Are you jealous? Well, I'm not surprised. Women aren't drawn to problematic punks like you. Damn it! Clean them up this instant! We're outnumbered. Let's scram before we get surrounded. We're not gonna do anything and just run? Thank God, you're head. Fine. We'll expose what you really are no matter what. You better be ready for us. <laughs> I was beginning to get bored of torturing the ones here. Come at me whenever you want, if you don't care about your life. <laughs> Ignore him. Let's go! Anyways, I don't remember changing into this. Uh, should I be happy about that? And again, <laughs> it ain't as bad as yours. Did you find them? Quiet. No, search that way. So what's going on? I'm completely lost, man. I told you before. When a Persona user opposes a palace's ruler and becomes a threat to them, this happens. It's to prevent you from being affected by distortions. Is this... a skull? Your appearance reflects your inner self. It's the rebel that slumbers within. Not that you'll get it. Nope. Then stop asking questions and accept what you see for what it is. <laughs> Easy for you to say. Wait, we're in deep shit! I said to be quiet! We might have gotten away here, but we're still screwed with Kamoshida at the real school. That's quite sharp of you. For being an idiot. Relax. The Kamoshida in reality can't possibly know. Shadow is the true self that is suppressed. A side of one's personality they don't want to see. So, we're okay? Did the Kamashita in reality remember about the execution? There you have it. All right. Now that we know that, all we gotta do is... Wait. I guided you as promised. It's your turn to cooperate with me. That's why I was super nice about teaching you idiots everything. Huh? Cooperate? Don't you remember? I originally came here for an investigation. I need to erase the distortion from my body and regain my real form. That's why we must delve deep into mementos and... Whoa, hold up. What are you going on and on about? We never said anything about helping you out. Huh? Don't tell me. Are you not going to repay the hospitality I showed you? Especially you! You're going to up and leave, even though you're already part of my master plan? Because I'm not human? Because I'm like a cat? Is that why you're making a fool of me? We're busy. Thanks for everything, cat. You've got guts being a cat and all. See you around. Hey! What the hell? Oh, seriously? Why are you wrapping this up like everything's all hunky-dory? Oh, hell no! Get back here! Thank God, we're back. Yeah, I dragged you around a lot, huh? Ugh, sorry, man. <sighs> I'm dead tired. How are you holding up? 
I guess you don't really show it, huh? But damn, if what we saw was for real, oh, this is gonna get good. I totally remember the faces of the guys Kamoshida was treating like slaves. Once we make him fess up to any physical abuse, Kamoshida will be done. So, wanna help me look for those guys or any witnesses? Now that's what I'm talking about! Hey, so if you're thinking of laying low because you got a record, I don't think that'll help. Everyone already knows. They totally got you pegged as a criminal. Kamoshida opened his damn mouth. No one else besides a teacher could have leaked it that fast. It doesn't matter if it's a student or a club. That asshole just wrecks things he doesn't agree with. Just like he did with me. No one will take anything I say seriously. Still, those rumors about him getting physical might be real. And after seeing Kamoshida's distorted heart thing in person, there's no way I can just sit back. I'm counting on you. Don't worry, I'm hyped about this too. Acting as a phantom thief would have been more efficient alone. You could have gone about it that way. However, you did not. There are merits to having associates. That's what you decided. Am I wrong? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the chariot persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. Oh, right. I haven't eaten anything since lunch. It'd be weird splitting off now. So why don't we grab a bite somewhere? Just follow me. I mean, I totally got to hear about your past. What? The hell, man? How much shittier can that asshole get? But just hearing your story makes me angry. So, you left your hometown, and you're living here now, huh? Huh, we might be more alike than I originally thought. You're the first guy that made me think that. I guess it's how we're treated like a pain in the ass by the people around us. Like we don't belong. I did something stupid at school before, too. The place you're living now is in Yongen, right? It's rush hour on the subways. I suggest you kill some time before heading home. What the hell, man? You barely touched your food. Just let me do it. I gotta thank you for helping me. Anyways, I got your back like you got mine from tomorrow on. As long as we do something about Kamoshida, I'm sure we'll both feel better about being at school. Oh, yeah! Tell me your number. Chat ID, too. Just you wait, Kamoshida. We're gonna start right away tomorrow. First, let's hit up those guys that were kept as slaves. The volleyball rally's tomorrow, huh? <laughs> Shit's recommended by Kamoshida. Makes me want to gag. But, thanks to that, we got no classes in the afternoon, and we can walk around unnoticed. Well, I guess we can work out the details tomorrow. Come on, you gotta eat more! There's tons of ginger here! <laughs> I 
haven't been sleeping well lately. Whenever I close my eyes, I keep thinking about too many things. Shio. Nationals are coming up soon, so I keep thinking. Should someone like me really be on the starting lineup? Don't worry. Just be confident in yourself. Your skills have been recognized. It's all because you work harder than anyone else. <sighs> yeah. Volleyball's all I have after all. More importantly, was that injury okay? It looked really swollen. No, it's nothing. It's normal. Especially since Amit's coming up. <sighs> Sorry to interrupt, Suzui. Um, Mr. Kamashita told me to get you. Huh? What does he want? He didn't say. <sighs> On, I... <sighs> It'll be fine. I bet it's a meeting about the starting lineup or something. <sighs> Yeah. Well, I better go. Yep. Good luck. Hang in there, Shio. Listen up. Welcome to the Velvet Room. I thought about resuming our previous conversation tonight. That is why I have summoned you. What are your thoughts? Are you becoming accustomed to this place? Ah, glad to hear it. It seems you have nerves of steel. Your rehabilitation determines if ruin can be stopped. Yet, such a feat cannot be done by you alone. But today, you entered a partnership with someone who awoke to the same power, haven't you? Involving yourself with others is an important foundation for your recovery. You've done well. That said, I am not advising the formation of superficial relationships. It must not be a frivolity, but a ring of those who would, by morals or faith, 
lend you their strength. In other words, they are bonds with those who have been robbed of their places to belong. The expansion of said ring will, in return, help you mature as well. Personas are the strength of heart. The stronger the bonds that surround you, the more power your personas will gain. There are countless people in the city who have talents that a weakling like you does. You better rack that noggin of yours and get them on your side. We'll change that into power. Indeed, you should be prepared to use even myself, or your ambitions will not come to fruition. <laughs> we have a deal then. shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the full persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that... All right. Well, you will understand it all in due time. Continue to vote. Now this conversation's over. Get lost, inmate. I can't do this.
Yeah. Talk to you for a sec. It'll be quick. Anyway, what's with you? Like how you were late the other day was a lie and all? There's that weird rumor about you, too. What do you want with him? Right back at you. You're not even in our class. We just happen to get to know each other. What are you planning on doing to Mr. Kamoshida? Huh? I see. I get ya. You're all buddy-buddy with Kamoshida after all. This has nothing to do with you, Sakamoto. If you found out what he's been doing behind your back, you'd dump him right away. Behind my back? What's that supposed to mean? You wouldn't get it. Anyway, people are already talking about you two. I don't know what you're trying to pull, but no one's gonna help you. I'm warning you, just in case. That's all. Why she gotta be so aggressive all the time? Ah, we just went to the same middle school. Anyways, that's not what we're here to talk about. I had no luck on my end. What about you? Did anything like someone's name turn up? Special coaching, huh? True. I always see the guy covered in bruises. Let's go talk to him before he leaves then. Hey, got a second? Sakamoto? And you too. Come on, we just want to chat. Kamoshida's been coaching you, huh? You sure it's not just physical abuse? Certainly not. What are you talking all polite for? Anyways, we saw him spike you today, right in the face. That was just because I'm not good at the sport. Still, 
That doesn't explain all the other bruises you've got. They're from practice! Is he forcing you to keep quiet? That's... What's going on here? Mishima, isn't it time for practice? Uh, I'm not feeling well today. What? Maybe you're better off quitting then. You're never going to improve that crappy form unless you show up to practice. Didn't you hear? He ain't feeling well. Well, Mishima, are you coming to practice or not? I'll go. As for you, any more trouble and you'll be gone from this school for sure. Bastard. Same goes for you. Didn't the principal tell you to keep in line? <laughs> Just don't get in the way of my practice. All these unsettling rumors are making the students anxious after all. That's your own goddamn fault. <laughs> this won't get us anywhere. Let's go, Mishima. Shujin Academy is a place where those with aspirations come to learn. Unworthy students like yourselves don't have any right to be here. Get with the program. Yes, sir. That asshole. He's gonna pay for this. There's no point. Huh? Proving that he's physically abusing us is meaningless. Everybody knows. Principal, our parents, they all know, and they all keep quiet about it. This has got to be a joke. Don't be a pain. You don't understand what I'm going through. Shouldn't you of all people know that nothing's going to help? <sighs> Damn it. I'll try one more time to persuade the other guys. That's... Shouldn't you be heading to volleyball? Uh-huh. That bruise above your eye. Is that from practice, too? Y yeah Are you sure you're not pushing yourself too hard? I'm okay. Volleyball's the only thing I can do right. Shouldn't you take that? It's probably just my part-time job. I should get going. Shiho, um, are you sure you're okay? Uh huh. Yes. T 
Today won't work. I'm... I'm not feeling so good. Sorry. Hey, wasn't that Takamaki? Rumor has it she's dating Kamoshida. Seriously? I heard people saw them in his car together. You know, she seems pretty easy, huh? You think I'd have a chance to? Come on, dude. You can't go after Kamoshida's bitch. <laughs> what is it? like? All of them kept saying the same shit Mishima was talking about. Kamoshida had to have told him something. At this rate, looks like we'll have to go to him directly. I know. But seriously, isn't there something we can do? No way I'm gonna give in like this. Can you think of anything? Oh, that'd be fine if we could do it without getting caught, but... If we did, we'd be seriously done for. You got any other ideas? So you want to tell them about the castle? They'd never believe us. <sighs> Have any other ideas? What do we do? The king? You mean that other world's Kamoshida? I didn't think of that, but is there any meaning to... I finally found you! You say something? Don't think you can get away with not paying me back for helping you. That voice... Is that you, Morgana? How dare you up and leaving me the other day! The cat's talking? I am NOT a cat! This is just what happened when I came to this world. It was a lot of trouble finding you two. Wait, you came to our world? <gasps> Does that mean you've got a phone? You don't need one when you're at my level. I did get pretty lost making my escape, though. That aside, why can you talk? You're a cat! How should I know? You hearing this, too? Then it really is Morgana. You guys are having a rough time of this, hmm. I heard you mention something about witnesses. Oh, shut up! You know, I could tell you a thing or two about what to do about Kamashita. You were pretty close just a moment ago. God, that condescending attitude. This thing's gotta be Morgana. You were still doubting me? God, quiet down! Uh, we really have to be looking for a cat in a busy time like this? I just heard a meow somewhere near here. Didn't you hear it? <sighs> Make sure you check every nook and cranny around. Meow? Does that mean only us two can understand what you're saying? Looks like it. What the hell's going on? Anyways, what you were talking about earlier, is it for real? You're quite the skeptic for being an idiot. Hey, tell us more. Then again, this probably ain't the best place. Here, stick it in your bag for now. It should be just small enough to fit. Hey! How dare you treat me like... Don't be so rough with me! Enough of that! You said you know how we can do something about Kamoshida, right? It has to do with what this guy was talking about earlier. You'll need to attack his castle. What do you mean? 
That castle is how Kamoshida views this school. He doesn't realize what happens in there, but it's deeply connected to the depths of his heart. Thus, if the castle disappears, it would naturally impact the real Kamoshida. What had happened? A palace is a manifestation of a person's distorted desires. So, if that castle were no more... Precisely. You sure pick up things fast. For real? He he's gonna turn good? But is that really getting back at him? Erasing a palace essentially means forcing the owner to have a change of heart. However, even though their warped wants disappear, the crimes they committed remain. Kamoshida will become unable to bear the weight of those crimes, and he'll confess them himself. You for real? That's possible? And since the palace will no longer exist, he'll forget what we did there as well. Not only will we be able to bring Kamoshida down, but there won't even be a trace of our involvement. That's amazing! You are one incredible cat! True. Except for the cat part. So, how do we get rid of the palace? By stealing the treasure held within. Stealing? I'll tell you more once you agree to go ahead with this. It's my most valuable secret plan, after all. If you want to help me out, I'll gladly teach you. What's your call? Our luck's running dry looking for witnesses. Guess we have no choice but to go along. Good. Oh, right. There's one more thing I should tell you. If we erase a palace, there is no doubt that the person's distorted desires will be erased as well. But desires are what we all need in order to survive. The will to sleep, eat, fall in love, those sorts of things. What are you getting at? If all of those yearnings were to vanish, they'd be no different than someone who is shut down entirely. They may even die if they're not given proper care. So... They might die! Will you listen to everything I have to say first? Would their death be our fault? Aren't you determined enough to face those kinds of risks? Hey, what do you think? For real? Sheesh. I come all this way and this is what I get. It's not like anyone will ever find out. That's not the point! If we just go around secretly doing whatever we want, we'd be no better than that effing Kamoshida. <sighs> Isn't this your only option? I'll come back later. Make sure you've made your decision by then. Man, we're getting all worked up for nothing. Damn it. I'll try and see if I can figure out another way. Come on, let's get out of here. Give it a rest? I told you, I'm not feeling up to it. Wait, what? That's not what you promised. And you call yourself a teacher? 
This has nothing to do with Shiho. Uh, <sighs> Shiho's starting position. Wait, were you? <sighs> Haven't you heard of privacy? Uh, no, I was out of line. Sorry. So, how much did you hear? Shio. It's nothing at all. Nothing. Anything to talk about with you. It was just an argument. Thank you very much! You've heard the rumors, haven't you? About Mr. Kamoshida. Everyone says we're getting it on. But that's so not true. <laughs> And that was him on the other line. I avoided giving him my number for the longest time. He told me to go to his place after this. You know what it means. If I turn him down, he said he'd take my friend off as a regular on the team. I've been telling myself this is all for Shiho's sake. I can't take it anymore. I've had enough of this. I hate him. But still, she was my best friend. She's all I have left of that sorry excuse of a school. Tell me, what should I do? <laughs> sorry, I shouldn't have asked. It's not your problem. I barely even talked to you before. <laughs> You're so weird. Usually everyone just ignores me. Are you really a bad person, as the rumor says? You just don't seem like it. That you assaulted someone. That you almost killed them. I kinda had a feeling they were all just exaggerations. You seemed lonely. Almost like you didn't belong anywhere. You're the same in that regard. Maybe that's why it was so easy for me to talk to you. Is there really no way for me to help Shio? I wish he'd just change his mind. Like, forget about me and... Everything. As if something like that would ever happen. <laughs> I wasn't asking for a serious response. But I do feel a bit better now. I'm gonna head home.
don't tell anyone what I told you, okay? I'll try and think of a way to persuade Kamoshida. Well, thanks. Suzui, are you leaving? What is it? Mr. Kamoshida's asking for you. He's in the PE faculty office. What did he say? I don't know. Well, I have to go. <laughs> On. Hey. Okay. 